Hey everyone, how's it going? So, growing up, one of my favorite monsters of all time was the creature from the Black Lagoon. So today, I'm going to show you how to draw a cartoon creature from the Black Lagoon. So to start off with him, we are going to begin with the eyes. So starting right here, I'm going to draw a circle. And then right over here, I'm going to draw another circle. Now, starting right here at the top, I'm going to draw a small circle on each side. And then in the center, I'm going to make another circle around here, and I'm just going to color this one in. So just draw a little circle in here, and then color it in, leaving some space around it. Now, starting right here, I'm going to draw a line that just kind of goes down, and then it's just going to curl around like this for an eyebrow. And then I'm going to start right here, and I'm going to do the same thing, just kind of curl around for a little eyebrow. Then, starting right here, I'm going to make an oval shape for a mouth. And then inside of here, I'm going to make another little oval shape. And then I'm just going to put a couple little bumps in here for some teeth and then just color in the rest of the space. Now starting right here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to go out and then come back in. And then I'm going to make another one that goes out and comes back in. And then I want to do the same thing here, just go out and come in and then out and then come back in. Then I'm going to make one more right here and one more right here. And then I'm just going to connect them with a curved line. Then starting right here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to go up and then down right here for the head. Then right here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to curve up and another one over here that's going to curve up. And then I'm just going to make a couple little curve lines going up. Now for the body. So starting right here, I'm going to just draw a line that's going to curve up. And then right here, I'm going to make another line that's going to curve up for the arms. Then right here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to curve around. And then it's going to come down and then back up like this. And then this one, I'm going to do the same thing. Just curve out, go around, and then come back. Then right here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to go up. It's going to curve down and then come back like this for one finger. I'm going to make another line that's just going to curve down and then come back like this. And then I'm going to make one more that curves down and then comes back and it's going to curve around to here for the hand. Then I'm going to draw a little curved line right here just to show where the hand is. Then starting here, I'm going to draw a line that's going to go down. And then as I get closer to the body, it's going to get a lot skinnier. Now in this one over here, I'm going to start right here. And I'm going to draw a line that's just going to curve out. It's going to go down and then come back here. Then I'm going to make a line that curves around and then comes back. And then one more right here. Then right here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to kind of curve around. 
and it's going to curve up like this. Then I'm going to make a big circle on here with a little dot in it for an eye. And then I'm going to draw so a little line like this to make it look like some fish lips. Then starting here, I'm going to draw a line that's just going to go down and then curve back up. And then I'm going to make it look like he's holding a fish, so I'm going to make a little wavy line down here for a tail. And then I'm just going to put a couple little lines on here. And then right here I'm just going to add a little wavy line for the fin. And right here I'll add a little line for the flipper with a couple little lines on it. Then starting here I'm just going to draw a line that's going to go down and get skinnier as it goes towards the body. Then starting right here I'm just going to draw a line that goes down at an angle and then another one that goes down at an angle. Then right here I'm just going to draw a line that just kind of curves down. And then I'm going to make a line that goes out and then curves back for a toe. Then I'm going to make another one right here. And then one more right here. And then I'm just going to take this line and then curve it back towards the body. Then right here I'm going to do the same thing. I'm just going to draw a line that's going to curve down. Draw one line that goes out and comes back for a toe. And then just do that for the rest of them. And then I'm just going to curve this back in and I'm going to meet it right here. Now for some little details. So I'm going to make some little curved lines on the toes. And then I'm going to put some little curved lines right here on them just to make it look like he's got some webbed feet. I'm going to make some little curved lines on the fingers just to show that he has some little claws. Then right here I'm going to draw a line that just kind of goes down and then comes back up. And then I'll draw a little one that goes up and right to the fishtail. And then I'm just going to put a few little lines on here. Then on his body I'm going to draw a line that just kind of goes down at an angle. It's going to go around and then come back up. And then I'm just going to put some more of those right down his body and they're going to get smaller and smaller as they get farther down. Then I'm just going to put some little wavy squiggly lines on his body just to kind of show that he has like some scales and kind of like some texture. I want to put a couple on the body up here and then even a few of them on his arms as well. Just a few little squiggly lines. Then I'm just going to make a little line right here on his head. And then a little line underneath here. I'm going to put a couple little lines on all of these little gills on the side of his face. And then a couple little curved lines underneath his eyes. Then I'm just going to draw a few little lines on his head. And there you go. There is your drawing of a cartoon creature from the Black Lagoon. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed.